Hey Niklas, let's do our longest product presentation ever with you. And we, we put all our products on, on the table, not all, but uh, let's say a short overview of, of the products. And I think for sure you're interested in the embedded or your, your um, um, viewers are mainly the embedded ones. A, a nice example, you, you can count um, below 10 seconds, for, for example, we did for a customer where um, on our embedded device um, the picture comes and it directly boots into um, a, a web page. And um, so, so this is uh, where we are focusing on, on um, industrial solutions which we completely customize. So um, on all the software we deliver normally it with a Linux kernel, on the um, um, embedded ones with an embedded Linux kernel and you can have our full source code and we, we um, put it also on our web page. So we uh, perfectly customize. And uh, what we do is that we do 7 inch until now 27 inch um, touchscreen devices, that's what we say. And we always go with, let me have a seat, we always go with um, that, that we say we have a patented rubber frame. And, and so it's, it's very easy, you can, you can install it in a, in a machine from the front and it's, uh, um, it's waterproof or you can install it from the back and it's waterproof and that's more or less um, the, the um, uh, product specification on which you can directly see it's a FATIC product so because sealing. the rubber protects it's it. It's sealing. Right, it's, it's sealing. And so it's, it's a nice freestanding. We used it a lot on, in buses, for example, because <laughs> when you hit it, it doesn't hurt so much. But uh, the main purpose is um, that, that you um, um, have, have a ceiling. And that's, for example, our um, um, standard uh, connection. Um, you have the um, power. You have the USB for, for the touch and then HDMI, VVI, VGA and audio for, for the connection. And this is a total standard um, touchscreen monitor. Again, freestanding with a stand or perfect for integration. And this we have as a full series. So we have a touchscreen monitor, that's our entrance. We have then our touchscreen PC. We, we go with an, a, let's call it also embedded PC solution, but embedded that way that it's slow. Um, so it's a Celeron processor, Intel, an N4000, uh, N4200 as a standard. And again, we have our um, connectors for sure. We do industrial, so it's important. They are locked, so they are total stable. You cannot get it off. We have a double LAN, which is for sure important when you have an inside and outside um, network, standard for USBs um, um, with USB 3.0 and USB 2.0. We have a full COM1 port. This is for sure for industrial devices quite important and we have the HDMI and the display port. Very interesting, we have um, behind this um, port a PCI Express, so you can connect um, very easy um, external cards. That's for, for industrial applications, interesting. And then we have on the um, other side really all, all connectors you, you, you can um, <laughs> dream of, I want to say. Like another full um, serial port, um, connector uh, DV9. Um, we have um, um, two small um, serial ports, um, um, 4 and 5, where you can switch between RS-232 or RS-485, still important for machine usage. And uh, behind this connector we have a 2.5 inch um, SSD slot, so you can easily um, exchange your, your um, SSDs. So it's a, from our point of view, a nice um, ruggedized um, design, no moving parts, that's important. You uh, can check in our company videos how strong vibration they survive. We test also all under minus 10 to 60 degrees. We have even products which we test from minus 20 to um, plus 70. And so in, in the other video, we, we, you mentioned the, the fast food chains, for example. Can you mention some of the other markets that are using these? We, we, we are, and with our touch PCs, our main market is Germany or the Euro European um, um, Union. And there, our main market is really like industry for zero. So you put it um, in the machine, you, um, you, so you steer machines with it. We have a lot of European um, customers who, who really integrate it in their CNC machines, their cutting machines, stamping machines. Um, um, we, we have some, some projects we, we show also on our webpage, even fitness machines. And um, the other ones is that you use it really to, to have your um, production process more efficient. That you have on every uh, um, working space a, a touch PC and you scan and, and put things fastly in and so have a more seamless uh, production. And again, there we have it as a monitor, we have it as a PC, we have it as an embedded device. Let's wait. Let's take 
where we have our embedded devices. It seems like just this one. No. We have right. too many too many products on the table and the people here, I'm blind. Yeah. And uh, the people um, put it away. So we have our embedded device also here, like the um, as a standard and all winner V40. So now for sure, your your viewers will say, "Oh my God, so old!" But again, for um, a machine um, workflow optimization or to to show um, um, a, a workflow and do some touches, that's absolutely no uh, no problems. And um, again, what's our specialty is that we can provide a full Linux kernel, which boots even in 10 seconds or an Android kernel, which, which we um, completely compile. And also there we have a GPIO ports, which is important, directly accessible. We have um, the SIM cards, easy accessible. Um, so we have um, a serial port. Um, and um, so we, we have, let's say, more the industrial solutions um, you, you want. We have extra no battery. That, um, that is a big problem on 24-7 systems, that uh, the tablet batteries go, go all defect. And, and so again, here it's also a ruggedized unit which, which runs perfectly in, in machines. Less power consumption also for the... Because sure. if you have it running all the time, it yeah. could be an issue. So all, all has also internal mini PCI um, Express. So you can, can um, add whatever, 4G cards, um, ad additional cards, M2 SR. What, what is now a, a really highlight is um, what, what we now just introduced. That's our um, um, i5, i7 series. And again, it has the same connectors. That's our um, market advantage that um, all the products, they have always the same connectors, always the same uh, things. And this is an uh, i3, i5, i7 model. Um, here the i5 7300U. And we are really proud of it. Also, this um, runs fully up to 60 degrees operation temperature. We used a very special um, heat pipe um, solution inside that it, it can run um, um, really under full throttle all four cores. You, you, you never go above um, 70 degrees um, 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 core temperature and this really took us some, some time. W what is also very special about this model, I hope you see it through the camera, is that our, um, our picture quality is better than what you should see from the competitors. That's um, because all our products are optical bonded. So we have just a 1.1 millimeter cover glass, um, which um, is on a um, glass glass sensor. We all produce in-house. Check our other videos to, to see how it is done. And because of this um, optical bonding, they survive IK08. So you can also that you can see a steel ball from one meter. You can fall it down and it survives. So it's really ruggedized. And um, the picture quality is good, especially when you look from the side, it's like um, it's, it's floating, the picture is floating. And that's what's, what makes our products unique. And this helped us growing quite strongly the last years. Um, hopefully some of your viewers um, get attracted and check also, there's still a lot of white spots. Well, there are no FATEC products sold, um, so I welcome everybody to check us out. Um, we provide good quality and more important, um, a good service and a good price. And uh, for example, let's say some target markets for this one, for example, what do you imagine? So um, the, the 27 inch is, is more like, there, there we are leaving already slowly the industrial world. The 27 inch, for example, is nice for kiosks or um, wayfinder. Um, um, there is a very big market or for, um, um, for sure larger overviews of, of workflow processes. Um, this one, for example, the smaller sizes that we see in, in uh, even operation centers, we have one, one unit which is medical, medical certified and um, we, we, have, we have a daughter model um, running in buses. So it's really, you, you can use it wherever you want to have a ruggedized unit, no moving parts. Um, um, which which uh, survives also a strong hit. You you can you can use the devices. And uh, also smaller, like let's say startups or companies with new ideas can approach you and do all kinds of cool stuff, right? For uh, sure. Like uh, if people have ideas for stuff like this or stuff like that, you made this happen, right? Right. right. This one, you know it. Um, we yeah. just had a talk about it that you saw one in Seattle, you told me. Yeah. And it's a Butterfly MX unit. We, we made a shoot also in, in New York, just when they started, 2015 or 2016. 
They grew now to 80 people and making uh, millions of millions of dollars. And I hope one good reason is because we are the exclusive supplier and provide them a good reliable um, solution. But it's right, we started with one sample and um, designed it for them following their, their expectations and, and that's what, what we do. That we have a standard product portfolio and that we are really good in, in doing customizations following your needs. So everybody who has cool ideas should approach you and say, hey, is it possible we do something new? Sure. It's, um, that's, that's how everything started and came out. You, you saw also the shopping cart, it's for sure. I love the shopping cart. <laughs> it looks so cool. There was one, one company who had the idea and we said, okay, we, we believe in it and let's go and, and do it. And so a complete shopping cart comes, really comes nice. out at the end. Right. Um, so in the other video you were mentioning it a little bit also. Maybe you can uh, grab the chair again. Sure. Right over here. Uh, you were mentioning the time to market, the time to engineer new solutions, or do you mostly um, focus on, on bringing like a standard thing that people do just run software on them? Our, theoretically, our dream partner is the one who, who won a project and, and has software expertise and has no hardware knowledge or doesn't want to um, be um, part of the hardware. Again, for example, the shopping cart. Our partner is a software company and they had a lot of hardware problems and then the scanner partner said oh my scanner runs well and the battery company which designed the battery charger said oh my, my, my charger runs well but at the end it didn't run well and, and so we, we said okay come on stop it we overtake full responsibility we do it right and then we, we are responsible for that the hardware runs and you just focus on your software. And like this, uh, I think we, we, we do also for Butterfly Mix exactly the same. Like this, um, projects run really well and, and successful. A typical timeline, you should still have 12, 12 weeks when you work with us. Uh, probably some other Chinese are, are faster, but for sure we start with doing the right specification, then you need a good design. We, we have a review, we start with the first prototype, this all really takes time. And um, building up the first prototype, Definitely we should have something like five to six weeks. You should make a review. You should make a first sample production again for five, six weeks. So uh, again, 12 weeks are, are fastly done. But I think it's, it's worth it um, when you have a good idea, right? And so your new uh, product range has got lots of more performance. What people are going to be using this performance for? It's, um, in, in, it's, it's very funny, you, you know, theoretically you know it. We, we believe also in that, that the mobile theoretically have enough power, we discussed uh, a lot about it, you know our FATIC flat which, which um, copies a, um, a mobile phone or um, where you can then even, even work with it, um, with, with a desktop. So basically I, I believe strongly in that, that um, you, you don't need so much power. On the other side, you know, software guys, I don't want to blame anybody, but they are also very strong in, in programming fastly and not too, too performance efficient. And it's really like that there are some, some big companies who, who really need an i7 or specify an i7 where basically I, I think totally an, an embedded solution will run. But I, I, I don't judge on the, um, on the software guys. We, we follow the specification. I, I know, for example, um, that um, our first customer, he was here, here he is, right now in the video. Schwerin from Meso, he's our first i5 customer. And you see what he's doing. Um, and this is really our device in the operation center. It's, um, 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 it's certified um, to be used um, in operations. And um, they use uh, the process um, performance um, for um, um, getting the images um, worked and, and get out of the operation center. This, this is an example for sure. Others um, have some, some machines where they do also then um, 3D calculations or uh, some special cutting calculation. Um, when, when you don't put the performance on the server, then you should have more performance on, on an, um, a processor. And I, I have to say, I'm, I'm really excited. Our new i3, i5, i7 series it's um, following our knowledge, 70% revenue of the market is done with solutions like this. So I'm, I'm really now curious when we introduce this uh, performance uh, solution, how, how it will work. And um, how old is your company now? And uh, who, are some of your old customers 
their device is still in use? It's, I, I was um, this year, last year in Germany, and I had uh, one customer, he said, total crazy, Mr. Weber. We have now um, products from you which we les listed nine years ago. And it, it's really, we have um, our first resistive touchscreen monitor series, still some customers use. And we, we put it in um, 2010 um, in, in their um, shop and, and offer. So, I mean, that's important for industrial um, customers that we, that we do long term. And um, we, we opened the factory here in Shenzhen. Uh, 2010, so now nine years ago. So for nine years we, we produce here, and um, with quite some some good success. So we we grew from there um, steadily. How long is do you provide the warranty on these, or is it customizable? If people want to say they they want it to work for minimum five years, or let's say I want a project ten years, can they talk to you? We have, um, that's missing, we have an open frame series where we um, use um, 100,000 hours um, LEDs and uh, so, so you really can use it for, for um, more than 10 years. Um, we, we give a standard two years guarantee uh, following the European um, standards and do this globally for, for all our products. But for example for um, Butterfly we, we agreed on a three and a support for five years. On the shopping cart, they um, for sure insisted on a five year support. So um, yes, it's, it depends on the project. Uh, we, we just need to check carefully also on NEC project. We even did seven years for, for a bus installation. We just should discuss it at the beginning and then double check that all the parts are perfectly fitting for, for that. And then maybe in the, in the value chain or in the system, you have a, what's called a support for the few defective units that might appear so you can kind of repair them without bringing them all the way back to China. It's um, so on, on um, good quantity projects we, we are running on below 0.5%. What, what is really important from when you check on um, let's say 10 defects which arrive um, at our service center, um, seven, sevens are just usage faults like uh, the user didn't use it right or connected it wrong and three are really defects and from the three again it's half 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 were by vandalism or wrong usage and half really were just the uh, product defects so what i want to say is when you have a project it's totally important to really discuss openly and analyze everything well um, be, because you, you you have most of the faults coming by wrong usage and when you check this together th then you can make a project successfully um, <laughs> One, one nice example just shortly, we had an Indian bus project and we made the project IP65 even that it was in buses and I, I didn't understand why anyhow. But we had a 100% defect rate and, and all had water in and I said that's impossible. No, no, impossible and, and so I, I, I went personally to, to India and everything looked nice and I, I didn't understand why, why they have water in. But I stayed full 24 hours with the bus and in the night the, the cleaning guys cleaned the whole bus with 20, over 20 bars water streams and this uh, IP65 specification is something like 2 to 3 bars, so 10 times <laughs> over specification. And that's the point, you, you really need to know wh wh when there's a problem coming, believe me it's normally not because of the hardware, um, but it's because of something strange happening and that you have to find out. Nice. So. Um I mean, this is uh, this is Im impressive products, and people can just buy them. Like they just do a phone call and say, "I want to buy," or did you even click on your website? How does it work? We have in um, um, our our main market is uh, still European and mainly Germany, and uh, there we have a business to business shop. We have um, also, let's say, local service in in Germany, in the U.S., in in China, in Japan, and in India. So we are um, operating now on almost all countries and there you can always buy it directly from Fatec. Um, but we, we basically when we say directly we don't focus on the end customer but for sure we focus on industrial customers and the system integrators and so we don't have the typical direct to end customer. We, we try it with, um, um, with the Fatec flat where, where we um, go, go more into, into the market. Um, probably this one is also a last nice Thing what I want to show basically all all our um, products um, we can disconnect it even now um, all our products um, um, have um, the pen support 
and um, you, you can you can use the uh, um, Fatec flat. I, I think very nice as a um, second monitor. So you just connect the um, the power to the to the USB C, and um, then then I think it's it's perfectly for um, for people who who for example wants to to um, write to to write still um, um, by pen. I, I have to say I, I do it. I can say whatever. Thank you for watching and um, for sure I, I did it with one note and I have um, a lot of a lot of um, um, notes now. What is really nice it has an automatic recognition that um, <laughs> that you don't make touches with your thumb. Anyhow so you can perfectly um, use it with your um, with your um, fingers, right, and still still write it um, you with did a pen. Something special about the touch screen layer or something? I, I mean, for sure, um, the the touch is one of our main uh, focus points and strong points. So so we really take care about that the pen works well, that the touch works well. Um, we we are really good where we tuned in um, water usage. We have also videos where you can use um, really with thick gloves uh, the touches. But this is again then something um, you can customize. And then uh, there's a big one right here. Uh, and how big do you get? How big is this one? This one is uh, 75 inch. We, we go up to 86 inch, um, but this is now uh, just a whiteboard. We have it staying here because we invented um, um, a mass pr product process for optical bonding. So um, the largest whiteboard manufacturer in the world uses our um, bonding technology. And we, we used um, under the logo Pure Bond um, 100 tons of glue um, just this year, um, filling up. Oh, that's now perfectly fitting, <laughs> filling up the small gap between uh, touch panel and panel, and um, uh, that that makes us also quite quite strong and unique in in that industry. No gap. No gap. No air gap. So the air gap is filled up by see-through um, um, glue. This makes all the products very, very um, r strong. And again, um, less reflection than on competitors. And we survive IK08 on all our products, even with just a 1.1 millimeter um, cover glass. So the display industry is really cool industry to be part of and you're doing a crucial part of that. You're taking the displays and putting the touch and making it industrial, rainproof, all that stuff. It's right. a lot of uh, an important uh, for partner for the display makers, right? For sure. Luckily now everybody wants to have a touch everywhere, right? It's um, children don't use a newspaper anymore but they touch and uh, you, you go on self kiosks you want to touch on machines you want to touch, you don't want to have any buttons, even in cars now. So, so for sure we are um, profiting strongly from the touch trend and, and there we, we have a good setup that we have here in China, our production, and um, um, provide then in all continents a good um, local service. When you are fast, ah, too slow. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> too slow. But uh, we, we have um, um, two. Um, we have now um, two factories in Suining. Okay, basically we didn't want to make any more the, the company presentation. But when we uh, go back, so these are our um, two two factories now in in Suining, um, where we manufacture. So we have um, for assembly in in China now um, more than 300 people. Globally, we are now 400, and um, so we grow out of Shenzhen to a second uh, place in the European American Industrial Park in Sweeney. I, I hope we can make uh, another shoot there yeah. probably next time. That'd be cool. So uh, things can scale very quickly. Mm -hmm. uh, this business can go from small quantities, which is still awesome, but can also go to very big. And you're ready for any, any potential. It's, it's really, um, the larger the quantity goes, the easier it is, because then you can perfectly optimize every process, you, you for sure invest more time in checking because the time you invest is always the same, right? And um, so um, we, we have now productions, uh, our typical production lot is 500 to 500 pieces, uh, 50 to 500 pieces, but um, we have also now first projects where we talk about 5,000 pieces production. So yes, I'm happy to get any size of, of orders. Even much bigger is, is okay? <laughs> it's cool for you? In, or does that mean in, you have to build more factories? In, in China it's um, still for sure. Um, to go big is quite easy. Um, our neighbor in Swinning uh, is Lear, an S&P 500 company. 
they hired in two weeks thousand people and got up the production in two weeks. It's, it's really crazy. So, um, okay, I, I think for example the shopping cart for sure is, is something where we we will make um, next year already 5,000 pieces and this has potential for hundred thousands of pieces. We, we discussed it in another video, so yes, we are ready and looking forward to it. I'm so looking forward to arrive in a supermarket and boom, it's there. Hopefully. <laughs>